Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to CADCAST number 109. I'm your host, GPD in Tokyo, Japan. And surprise, this is Mrs. Wombat. Wow, that's <laughs> that's some surprise. <laughs> I just am here to announce to the CAG public that I have the future of video gaming in my belly. Really? Really. Wow, congratulations. Thank you. That is really funny because I was I was going to ask today actually if you guys were planning on having a, a little and well, we're past the planning stage. <laughs> <laughs> now you're just trying to figure out how to leave the country, right? Uh, yeah, I've already booked my flight to Mexico. I have a fake passport. It says Miguel Sanchez. <laughs> I plan on leaving tomorrow. Do you know if it's a boy or a girl? We actually just found out today that we're having a little girl. Oh, how disappointed are you on that? Oh, I'm thrilled. I'm I'm already waiting <laughs> for the arrangement. <laughs> what is the dowry procedure with the, with the in Japan? Oh, I don't think that works that way anymore. Really? No. No. Damn it. <laughs> no. Sorry. Sorry to tell you that. But wow, big news. Very big news. So when do you do, Mrs. Wombat? I am due. My due date is July 20th. All right. So we've known now. We've known since November. Right. So it's been a while. That's pretty awesome. So, I, I mean, did you have any idea? No, I didn't. I figured that because, you know, you got a house and it was just sort of a matter of time before it happened. We found out. Yeah, well, we were, yeah, we were going to, we had... When it got into contract on the house and then found out like a few weeks after. I see, I see. Well, so it's just a weird coincidence. You Now you get to live through my hell. I mean, my joy. <laughs> Did I say hell? I meant sheer joy yeah, all the no, time. No, you mean hell. We know it. <laughs> no, no, no. It's it's actually, it's it's great. And I I think you're, you know, you'll be great parents. Not that I really know you, but I'm just saying that, of course. Well, you know me well um, enough, I think. No, not really. <laughs> If you if you neglect the kid the way you neglect the cad cast, I mean, you're going to be put in jail, I think. Oh, I went there. Well, if you I take went as long as it takes you to get ready for doing the show as it does for you to go tend to your child when it's in need. Right. I think you. I'm not the only one who's going to need child protective services. I, I hear no complaints from the child. <laughs> yeah. Wow. Well, that's great, Wombat. That is that is great. So you now now when you know I talk about Ty, you have a lot. You know, you you just get prepared, Wom. Nothing can really prepare you though. You you will find that out soon enough when that kid pops out and it's just it's you and Mrs. Wombat staring at each other, staring at the kid, going, "Now what happens?" Well, now you know why with Mrs. Wombat having been sick for the last two and a half weeks. Why it's been such a nightmare for both of us because she can't take any medicine. Oh, yeah. That's no good. No. No good at all. What so, about the... Is there, has there been a lot of morning sickness? Morning, evening, <laughs> afternoon. Yeah. Yeah. For my wife, it was really like evening sickness. I remember her like... <laughs> we would go out for dinner and... We'd walk outside the restaurant, and she would basically have to throw up immediately. And she would like throw. I'd have to try to like find her a quick place on the st- on the street somewhere that she could like duck behind a vending machine and and puke. You that haven't thrown job. up in public yet. Uh, no, I have not thrown up in oh, public yet. No. She did. She th- she threw up on like the subway platform. I think people probably thought she was just a, another alcoholic <laughs> in Japan, another Japanese alcoholic. <laughs> but uh, wow, big news! So June, you said. July. July. July, July. Okay. Wow. Right near my own birthday. So. Wow. All right. Your life as you know it is pretty much over. Yeah. Do whatever, <laughs> and whatever you wanted to do, do it now. <laughs> Anything yeah. that you wanted to do in the next four years, just do it quickly. Yeah. Good luck with that one. <laughs> right. Like go to Mexico. Exactly. We did that already. At least we already did that. Did you enjoy my... Um, my little video on YouTube with featuring starring Ty. Oh yes, I loved it. The 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 red ring of fire. Right. I figured I had to get something good out of my second Xbox 360 breaking. Um, it was pretty funny because it actually did. You know, I Ty was playing, and our I have a little like uh, 
activity mat for him. And I was like, oh, he seemed pretty content right now. Let me see if I could fire up Guitar Hero and whip out a few songs. And sure enough, the 360 froze. And the next time I turned it on, uh, I got the Red Ring of Death. And coincidentally, at that time, Ty started crying. And then the little light bulb went above, uh, came out above my head. Said, hey, I can make a little entertaining video out of this. Uh, so I remembered I had that shirt that uh, I guess it was Jay Rutz sent me that shirt at, that said Achievement Unlocked on it for Ty. And I put the video together and I had to, you know, I just had to just wait for Ty to start crying again. So I didn't like beat him or anything. I just sort of put him in the chair, set everything up, left the Xbox on and just waited. <laughs> I played the waiting game. You just kept showing him the top of your head and going, when you're an adult, your hair is going to look like this. <laughs> right. I'm hoping they'll have big breakthroughs in medical science to fix that for for him. Maybe. Um, you might get lucky. It's funny because like, uh, a, a lot of the comments on Dig and YouTube, uh, not a lot, but some of them were saying, oh, you're such a bad parent. Your kid's crying and you're not, you know, you're not uh, fixing it. Like, like that's something you can really fix. Um, but, and you'll realize soon enough that sometimes the kid just cries because he's a baby. Yeah. And oh, he and cries. She, Mrs. Wombat left the room, so you can say whatever you want now about her. It's cool. Oh no, I wasn't. Gonna I, say I that. know. Really? Right. right. <laughs> no, but that's. Uh, so I just wanted to throw that out there. I was not abusing the kid. It's it's actually good for the kid to cry. It's that's how they get exercise at this tender age. Um, and I I did a grand total of fifty three seconds of filming in one take so i think the kid's gonna be okay i don't know i think you traumatized him for life shima thought it was funny and my mother-in-law thought it was funny and it was the number one video in japan for a day in youtube japan really for one day and it was number 11 on youtube uh america congratulations yeah it has a hundred over a hundred thousand views in like two days your kid's a star so he, he is a star i will pimp my kid out for page views or video reviews. I will do it. I will. As long as it doesn't, uh, it's not too degrading. There's, that's I a fine line in itself. I mean, you know. Right. 